thing. By the way, if you own a villa in Dubai, you must install fire alarms before January 1 or face a fine. Uh, this has actually been announced back in 2020. It's finally being in- implemented on the 1st of January 2024. You must install a specific alarm in your property and subscribe to Hassan Tuck, which is the UK, uh, excuse me, UAE alert system. Uh, this was a ruling, as I said, announced back in September 2020, and it comes into play at the beginning of the year. Hassan Tuck is a fire safety solution. It monitors homes in the UAE for 24-7 for any fire-related incidences. And by the way, apartments, you guys already have them, and it is the responsibility of the landlord to implement the system. And so if you are wondering what are the costs, the base plan is ideal for the villas with three bedrooms, and it will cost you around 415 dirhams per month for a year or half that and pay 230 dirhams for 24 months for a two-year subscription. You can also, by the way, choose to pay 6,000 dirhams for a lifetime subscription. Now, the Hassan Tuk system is a sophisticated system. It will send a notification of fires to the civil defense and should a fire break out, of course, if it happens. Now, provide firefighters as well with the exact location and also show the fastest route to get there. So if you're questioning the fee, it's worth noting, your plan features one fire alarm panel, which kind of looks like a little iPad. You get nine wireless smoke detectors throughout your home, a wireless heat detector, installation, monitoring, and maintenance. So this is a full service to to protect your home from fires. Um, It's called Hassan Tuck. It is mandatory in all villas from January 1st. The prices we've given, as we said, are for a three-bedroom villa. And then you could actually make that custom because most villas... A lot of villas are more than three beds, so you can actually uh, increase your plan and increase the number of like wireless detectors based on it. But by the way, this is mandatory from January 1. If your landlord hasn't put it in, you need to let them know. It is as well for... this link. Yes, you should, because it's even for safety reasons, right? We see a lot of fires break out in exactly Dubai, for. and um, sadly, Dubai only would implement such rules. It's for your for your safety, and if it's not for that, I don't think um, it would be ideal, or anyone would want to have their house, you know, burnt out or their villa. Because then, if it's like a bil- a building, let's say, and a fire broke out, there's this fire alarm that's already installed, and it's gonna go, and fine, everyone's gonna go down uh, the stairs, and everything's fine. Good job. Fine. Exactly, and it specifically yes. connects mm-hmm. you exactly. to the UAE. Uh, fire brigade so it's like a it's like a wireless connection so it's not just like your regular fire alarm that alerts you it alerts the authorities so it's like a full plan for for the for the villas right as well because villas are very like um you're not living with everyone else in the building you're living with like in your own i would say sacred area and that as amazing as that is as well there are a lot of dangers so it's all the time better to be safe than sorry I have this as well. This is my advice. There <laughs> so you go. Talking about advice. Yes. And now 